This dancing girl is Micah. And Micah is a three and a half to four year old spade female Jack Russell Terrier uh, mix. And uh, she is 15 pounds. And she is 15 pounds of smart, inquisitive, fun, happy energy. Uh, Micah loves playing with her toys. She will fetch and fetch and fetch. Um, and she's doing it really nicely right now. Um, that's her favorite little bunny right there as well. Uh, she loves chicken. We were just discussing how she's got kind of a discerning treat palette. She's a great eater at mealtime, but um, doesn't seem to like commercial treats. So <laughs> she's she's uh, getting rewarded for her good behavior and for her training with chicken and hot dogs. Um, so Micah, she's a little slow to warm up to new people, but once she knows you and has a relationship with you, um, she becomes very affectionate, very loving, very entertaining, eager to please. She's smart as a whip, so if you're somebody who likes doing training, likes teaching tricks, Micah is a perfect, a perfect uh, companion and best friend for you. <laughs> we would like to see Micah uh, go into a home as the only dog in the home. We've had her go on walks with other dogs. When we rescued her from the shelter, she was in the kennel with other dogs. And she's perfectly capable of being a really, really good, nice citizen. Um, but she doesn't like to share her toys and things like that with other dogs. She gets a little possessive with other dogs while it's in her home, in her space. She's playing with flies right there. Um, so we think she'd really be best as your one and only little little pet, your little girl. Um, but she'll love to go for walks and can go for walks and um, socialize in that way. Um, what else can you tell us about Micah? Um, well, the, the probably most practical thing is she can be left alone for hours. She clearly was with somebody who probably actually had to work for a living and was gone for a normal amount of time. She is absolute gold. She hasn't uh, made any kind of accident or gone after anything in the house that wasn't already hers. You know, yeah. She will show up her toys, but that's about it. So she's, very, she's a very good girl that way. And she, she doesn't have separation anxiety. As attached as she becomes and as loyal as she becomes, she does not, uh, she hasn't developed any separation anxiety. And you were saying she's totally house trained. She's what? Totally house trained. Oh, yeah. She's, yeah, she's thoroughly house trained. She would rather, you know, hold it for hours rather than, it, she, and she has access to the yard, but she'd rather do it on a walk. She ah. prefers to, she, she will do it, uh, do her business right. in the yard, but she prefers to be on a leash. I guess <laughs> what she's used to, I don't know. Um, but what else? She's just, she's a funny little girl. She loves, as you can see, she loves to play fetch. She loves to walk. And the other thing she loves to do is just hang out. She'll sit on the couch for very comfortably for hours, or she'll lay at your feet if you, if you work uh, at home or right. sit at the kitchen table. She's very, very content. And I think you said she just seems really smart. I guess that's the breed. You know, she's, right. she's so trainable. I, I, she, she does react to people when they come in the house, although she's getting better about that. But I decided to see if she could stop barking at the doorbell. And in just three or four attempts, she instead of barking, she looked at my hand, like, where's right. the chicken? You know, right. so she's really smart that way. So she's not very attractive. Micah! Yes. Good, Good girl. girl. Good girl. Yes. Well, this beautiful girl is Micah and she is looking for her forever home. So we'd love to see her go into the home as the only dog where she can get your attention and have a good leader and become your best friend. So if you're interested in meeting Micah, please contact United Hope for Animals. We can see. Thanks, Micah. <laughs>